Pookie, I'm so tired of never getting Phantom. He net all of my plans always fall through, and he's never mine at the end. Uh, Oh, you're right. We do live right next door to a witch. Yes, yes. She likes to collect souls and make love potions. I think maybe I can grab one from her if she wouldn't mind. No, it's not illegal, Pookie. It's totally fine. Let's go see what she's up to now. Hocus Pocus went on the wall, Hocus Pocus went on the wall, give me all the souls I need! <laughs> oh. oh my god, out of all the souls that I need, you are not the one I want, Gretchen Weiner. Matilda, I am offended. Uh, <laughs> there are plenty of people who want my soul. Oh yeah, like who? Go ahead, name a person. I'm waiting. Oh, um, that's not the point. The point is, I came to ask you for a favor. Uh, uh, Shut up, Pookie. I do have somebody that wants my soul. Ah, uh, yes, a favor. What is it that you want, Gretchen? Hurry it up. You see, um, I just need a simple task. I just need a love potion. <laughs> a love potion? You... Gretchen, not even a love potion can get you what you need. But please enlighten me. Why would I help you with a love potion? Well, if you give me a love potion, that means I will move in with my lover Phantom in his new mansion. And I won't be your neighbor anymore. Wait, what? Are you telling me that you would actually move out if I give you this love potion? Yes, yes. I would move out effective immediately. Quiet, Pookie. Hmm. You know what? You have yourself a deal. Excuse me while I go ahead and brew something real nice. And remember to keep your end of the bargain. Or else I will come after you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just get you the potion already. Up! Abracadabra, alakazam. Watch magic happens right on my command. Okay, here you go, Gretchen. Take these and make sure that he eats it with food or else he'll have a stomachache, okay? Oh, um, okay. Thank you very much. Yes, 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 my darling. Now be gone and remember to start moving out by the end of today. I want you out of my life! Yes, of course, Matilda. Anything you like. Well, I hope that potion works because, not gonna lie, not even Jesus Christ can help that woman. Oh my god, bestie, look! Uh, it's a raccoon! Isn't that your ex-boyfriend? Oh my gosh, that time I did not date the raccoon, but he is a little trash digger. So <laughs> I guess that suits him. Yeah, you're right, bestie. He is a trash digger. Ugh, disgusting! Yeah, but guess what, Phantom? What happened, bestie? What do you want to tell me? Okay, so I know I kind of have a crush on coffee that I'm trying to get over, but I met somebody online and he's kind of cute. Look! Wait, what? You met somebody online? This I have to see. Um, oh my god, Brushy, he's a 10. <laughs> or 11. Look at those abs. <laughs> Yeah, and he also plays video games like me. That's how we met. So we've just been taking it slow. He's just my friend. But yeah, I just thought he was super cute. Isn't that fun? Aw, bestie. I'm going to be happy for you. But just be careful just in case. I mean, do you want me to be with you? Like, when are, when are you going to plan on meeting him, actually? Um, I don't know. Maybe soonish. But I'll definitely let you know. Because, yeah, you never know who's on the other side of the screen. Yeah, for real. I sure had my fair shares of little rats and liars uh, and people that promised you that they were going to be there and they're never going to be there every more. But it's okay. We're not going to talk about that. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, I'm sorry, bestie. But anyways, let's change the subject. What about you? How have you been? Honestly, everything was okay. Except for that one time I had the bodyguard hit on me. Although he was cute. I told him to keep it professionally. But you know what? Mm, I don't know. Maybe I might call him sometime soon. You never know. <gasps> Ben 
momentum. Yes, let's go on a devil date if I ever get another date. But yeah, that sounds fun and exciting. Yeah, he seems like a nice guy. Like, you know, like I thought maybe, you know, we could try to hit it off. Who knows? But, you know, I got to keep myself like, you know, like away and, you know, very uh, mysterious. Yeah, exactly. You got to stay mysterious and always stay single and happy, too. Well, not forever, but you know what I mean. <gasps> oh, look, Ernest is messaging me. He wants to play games right now. I think I'm going to go, Phantom. Oh, OK. Excuse me. Ernest wants to hang out with you now. OK, Busty, let me not stop you. I hope you have fun. Yeah, definitely. Maybe in the future you can play with us soon. But yeah, I'll talk to you later, Bestie. Bye. Bye, Bestie. All right. Well, I guess it's time for me to make some dinner. I'm going to make some tacos. Pookie, I don't just come on Phantom's house when it's raining. It just happens to be raining when I'm at Phantom's house. Shut up, Pookie. Let's go. Oh my god, what a strange day to be raining right now. It said it was gonna be like nice and dark and stars are gonna be outside. This is not what I was expecting. Oh my love, you're so far yet so close. <laughs> Shut up, Pookie. It is not illegal to go into someone else's property and break in. He is my husband. You're the one that's delusional. Let's go, Pookie. Alrighty, let me go get my computer, take a shower real quick, come downstairs, and I already have my tacos set up, so yeah, let me go ahead and do that. Actually, let me just take a small bite, because I'm just really hungry. This taco is so good. Okay, 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 fine. I have to go upstairs, take a shower, get my computer, and start to do some research. The itchy bitchy spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain and washed the spider out. Here we are, Pookie. We're ready to put the love potion in the tacos. <coughs> yeah, we could take a bite. He's not gonna notice. Okay, the potion is done, Pookie. Let's go. <coughs> Oh, I hear the water going. It sounds like someone is taking a shower. <coughs> no, Pookie. This is for my eyes only. You need to close them. This is for adults. <coughs> Let me just take a little look. <coughs> oh, my. That was so worth it. What do you mean, Pookie? I should not be ashamed of myself. I have every right to go in there. I am his wife, and it's a public place. Ah, ah. Okay, let's go, Pookie. Ah, uh, I love taking a shower with my anti-waterproof clothes. It makes me feel clean. It's better than taking off my clothes, because you never know who's watching me. Uh, okay, now that I'm done, all I gotta do is go to the kitchen, eat my food, and call it a day! Alrighty. Alrighty, time to eat my tacos. Alright, maybe I could just put the computer down. <laughs> yum, 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 yum! Uh-oh. Why do I... Uh-oh, I feel a little tired. Maybe I ate a little too much. Uh, time for me to go... Sleepy. Oh, my love. Let me take you to your bed. You seem like you're in a trance. <laughs> we need to get my husband to our bed. No, this is not wrong, Pookie. We are married. Oh, my God. You're so heavy. What the heck do you eat? <coughs> no, Pookie. You should be the one talking. Not me. Here you go, my love. You look so nice and comfy. <coughs> okay, okay. I'll fix him up. Tomorrow for sure. What the heck? What is taking him so long? He's been sleeping for eight or nine hours. Wake up! No, Pookie, the potion is real. Oh, he's waking up. My love, good morning. Uh, 
my head. What is, what is that sound that I hear? That sounds like a voice of an angel. Shut up, Pookie. I do not sound like a wildebeest. Even though you sound like a wildebeest, you are the true love of my life. Aw, finally. It's happening. <laughs> I'm not cheating, Pookie. This is the only way he could have actually liked us. My lady, where would you like to go? Um, I would like for you to carry me to the kitchen. Sure, anything for you. Oh my, you're so uh, strong. You're so heavy, my lady. Don't call me fat, I'm pregnant with your child. Uh, I'm just trying to move. Uh, uh, uh. Oh my gosh, I am so sorry. It's okay, my lady. Oh, you're standing on me though. Sorry. Um, I wasn't hungry anyways for this food. I want you to take me out on a nice date. Yes, anything you like, my lady. But first, I need you to change your clothes because what you're wearing is ugly. <laughs> what do you mean, Pookie? He looks disgusting. He needs to look like a man. Yes, anything for you, my lady. Phantom! Hello! I left my phone, Phantom! I need it! Oh, I have the key. I forgot. I'm just gonna run in. <laughs> Ooh, I found it. Here it is. Mmm, and I smell some tacos. <laughs> I hope Fanta doesn't mind if I take a bite. Wait, what is this? It says prescribed to Gretchen from Matilda the Witch. Love potion. <gasps> Gretchen Weiner. He put a, she put a love spell on Phantom. I have to find him. My love, this is the most romantic place that I've chosen. <coughs> Be quiet, Pokey. Ah, oh, yes, Gretchen. I've been itching to tell you this for a very long time. Yeah, what is it? Stop right there. Kitty, now is not the time. Cookie, do not ruin this. We do not need Kitty. Phantom was just about to ask me the most important question in the world. Oh my god, Gretchen, what have you done to Phantom? He looks like my uncle, your dad. That's kind of creepy. He does not look like my dad. How many times do I have to say it? Gretchen, this needs to stop immediately. And you know what? I did some hacking and I found out exactly where Phantom was. And I also found out that Matilda is your landlord. And I, I'm going to tell her that you're actually not leaving so that she's going to put a curse on you because you lied to her. Uh-oh, Pookie. Looks like we got in trouble again. What do you mean I'm getting in trouble? You're in it too, Pookie. We're partners in crime. I'll get my revenge, kitty. Just you wait. Oh my gosh, I honestly don't know how she does that. Phantom, drink this, hurry! Uh, my head. Ah, what happened? Why am I wearing these clothes? Ew, I look like somebody's father. Oh my god, this is, this is caca colors. What the heck am I wearing? Phantom, you're awake! Gretchen put a love spell on you and she made you look like her dad! Uh... Ew! Oh my god, I almost was gonna... Uh, uh, marry her. I think that was what was about to come out. It was so weird. I felt like I was in a prison. I was just like, help, help me! And somebody was like, taking over my body and I couldn't say anything. It was so disrespectful. I was like, I do not love that woman. You need to chillax. Yeah, she is so weird, Phantom, but let's just get you home and like, figure out how to get this. You're gonna probably feel really bad the rest of the day. No, it's okay, bestie. You know what would make it better? We're gonna, we're gonna eat dinner. By the way, I managed to steal her card, so now we're gonna use it on her. <gasps> oh, yeah, let's get some food then. I'm yeah, hungry. Let's go. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> see you guys. Uh oh, Pookie. Looks like Matilda found out that I was lying about leaving. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have to change our identity once more. Oh well, be sure to like and subscribe. And remember, if you love someone, make sure you get the love potion from the witch.